Well, uh, I just made a boo-boo. Uh, pretty big boo-boo, uh, not gonna lie. Uh, I was in the midst of recording this, and then I realized that the audio was borked somehow, some way. Usually OBS is uh, really good about about making sure the audio is good, but for some reason it just, nah, just went bad halfway through my recording. So I'm just going to restart this, and hopefully nothing bad happens again. So anyway, this is my Vanoss slash Machinima uh, gamer tier list. Now... I know that there's some people missing from this. I know Hutch isn't here. Diction is not here. I know Z isn't here. I know there's a lot of them out there, but these are the ones that mainly consistently I have tuned into, stayed subscribed to, or followed, or remained a constant subscriber of on Twitch. And yeah, basic, uh, basically, no pun intended, um, we're going to rank them from where I see them. I, I love most of these guys like a whole lot i mean they're like a, one of the big reasons why i think youtube gaming has effectively become this what they what it is now but uh we're going to start here with basically i do work and i'm gonna put basically i do work i would put him i, I would put him in a tier it if it were like the if the editing was a lot like how it was back when he was doing death run i remember like the mario death runs back in the day those were those were hilarious uh, and they were also like really well done, but I'd say nowadays uh, I I and I, I know Puffer's probably gonna you know be in the comments down below be like how what do you mean and I was like it's not that he gets but it, it's just a different editing style and plus Mar Marcel's channel is still gaining subs so nothing else can be said except for the guy is the guy is still consistently very very funny so I I always find Marcel to be very funny I think some of his rants and also him going after. Uh, cheaters in game is probably some of the best footage ever recorded uh like when he took on that one cheater in uh black ops where he was just like Can you turn off your hack now? no i didn't you missed the 14 and one last round you can't get a kill this game turn your hacks back on i don't have hacks dude. you need them though because you're really <laughs> <laughs> you, you, need, you need to take them you don't have them though i'm gonna kill them i'm behind you still so roasting him right now <laughs> you gotta turn them on you can't kill anything Dude, if I turn them off, I'm still gonna get kills regardless. You didn't, you didn't have any kills with them off. I don't want to do you, you wanna put money on it? Do you wanna put money on it? Turn it's because I'm sitting there. Alright, pussy. Alright, you fucking pussy. Fucking see me. He's mad as fuck, dude. He's so angry. How did he make him so angry in short space of time? What the hell? No, he was going at him for a while. Oh. <laughs> oh god. When you you know they're mad when they fucking shove the mic down their throat, calling them out and going in on them and loving every second of it. And also uh also some of his screams are just uh just uh they're so so funny. But yeah, that's that's where I put basically. And now we move on to Bryce. Bryce, I have watched a little bit of and I would say is probably I'd say on his own can be funny, but just with his style of the way his videos are edited, I don't know. It's it's hard for me to really say consistently he is like I'd say it. Keep in mind, guys, this is this yeah this doesn't do justice to how I truly feel. I have nothing against Bryce. I think Bryce is really cool. I think he's had some very very funny moments with the crew, but by himself and uh, just just overall. I'd say I haven't I haven't had that good of an experience with him. So uh, okay, now we move on to cartoons. Cartoons. I oh god, it's hard for me to put him between either A or B because to me B. Uh, I, I the reason why I'm putting him in B is because I would say probably I I don't know. I I tune into him a lot. I tune into him and I tune into Delirious a lot. I often see. Like the custom kill animations that they have for Among Us. Girl right there, Jihee, come here. Come here, Jihee. Fuck you, Delirious, you gotta go. Watching him and uh, Delirious go back and forth in uh, Friday the 13th. I fell off the fucking cliff! <laughs> bitch, you about to drown! No! No! You messed me, bitch! No! Come here, you know what? Please! It's time for you to get your fucking shit choked! No, you're not As this fell! Fuck you, Mitty! 
Also, uh, him and Gorillafant and uh, Dead Squirrel and Delirious make up their own little pocket of the gaming universe, and I'd say, you know, consistently funny across the board. Uh, it's just his style of editing I, I, I think is good, but, but again, B-tier does not mean bad. It means really, really good. Uh, so, yeah, that's where I stand with uh, cartoons. We now move on to Chilled Chaos. Chilled Chaos, a classic gamer in terms of uh, legacy, you know, one of, uh, you know, back when he was with Machinima and Respawn and everything, and also he's gamed with uh, Scene Anners and Me Gassy Mexican throughout the years. I would probably say I would put him a solid A. Now, the reason for that is because of, number one, the legacy. Number two, he's had to restart and uh, redo his channel multiple times, and he's starting fresh again, I believe, and now he's he's gaining ground again, and I'm, I'm glad because Chilled, I, I will always remember when Chilled trolled the shit out of Adam, uh, C. Nanners, uh, in Stop It Slender, when he pretended he was uh, one of the survivors, but in truth he was Slender. Do you know where the pool was? Do you go to the pool? I'm cool. taking care of shit. Okay. Okay! Okay! I'm not going to the pool anymore! <laughs> Why can't you come and visit me? You fine, fine. I'll meet you back by the pool. Here? There's two doors by the pool. Come back in the pool. I'm by the front door by the pool. Oh, no, he's by the pool, dude. What the fuck? I don't see him. Hands down, like, some of the best trolling ever done in game. Especially to someone like Adam, who's usually the one doing the trolling. But, uh, yeah. Chill Chaos. Solid A. I, yeah, I put him there easily. Uh, still very funny to this day. Now, we move on to H2O Delirious. Now, Delirious... Him and Cartoons have some of the best chemistry in gaming. I believe uh, their videos, whenever they're working together or against each other, whenever they're playing Injustice. You about to get that like shattered, bitch! Oh, you about to hear the oh. screech! No screech! Oh. Oh. oh, oh god, you shot me right in the pit! Son of fucking titty! <laughs> oh my god! Good shit. Hilarious. Across the board. Uh, also, uh, the Dad Club. I'm, I'm not a father myself, but... Uh, the Dad Zone, welcome to the Dad Zone there, Delirious. I mean, I know that there's multiple YouTubers on this list here who have kids. I know Moo does. I know uh, Nogla, recently a member. Well, now recently publicly a member. Uh, Sark as well. He's got two. Uh, good Lord. Just good luck, and I hope that I hope that your baby girl uh, turns out well, man. I mean, well, what the hell am I talking about? She's got you and Cat raising her. Of course she's going to turn out great. But anyway, we now move on to Droid, Silent Droid. Um, no, no frills here. I'm just going to be honest. I'd probably put him in C tier because Droid has had some funny moments, but I would say I probably tuned into his channel the least, like his probably I've tuned into the least, uh, outside of a one or two others on here, but Droid has had some very funny moments. Uh, for instance, the, uh, twist glitch on Grand Theft Auto 5. So majestic with the stars in the back. <laughs> 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 Doesn't mean he's a bad gamer. I I'd love to see more from him. I hope to see more from him. Uh, but yeah, that's basically where I am with that. All right, four zero seven, Scotty. I would probably say solid B. I flirt with A on Scotty, especially whenever he goes on one of his rants and gets super angry and does that that really, really, really big scream and just, you just hear the kettle about to pop off and then he just lets it rip. Oh God. This game fucking blows! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I missed that. <laughs> you feel it. And that's that's why I put him solid B tier. I flirted with A tier with him, but yeah, again, that's, uh, yeah, Scotty, Scotty's very, very funny. Uh, Cryos, John, I know if John were to, John were here, He'd probably just say something like, put me in F tier, daddy. That's where I belong. Yeah, because that's just how John is. But I'm going to be honest. I'm putting John in B tier because John has great consistent chemistry with a lot of people around the internet. It's just the videos on his channel. I have not, I, I, I can't really, I haven't really been able to get into the videos on his channel, but he has provided some hilarious moments with Grizzy, the Do with uh smitty especially smitty him and smitty god i'll never forget when they ruined the wild cast by the way we have smitty that's john good friend of mine what you're smitty right yes hello i'm 
We can't be doing this this bit twenty you seconds have bear into fists? this shit. We got it. Tyler's pulling out his phone to make sure he's nah. talking Fantastic. to him. Fantastic. Hey, whoa, yeah, Smitty. Don't put your arm up like that, buddy. Smitty. Give I'm a Jewish. sponsor. So, yeah, Cryas, easily a B tier. Um, if videos were a little bit better edited, I'd say A tier, but that's just me. Anyway, uh, moving on. Uh, we now move to Louis. Louis Caliber. Uh, let's see. I would probably say... Given he hasn't uploaded in so long, and also uh, the consistency of of editing in his videos uh, during, while he was posting was going down and down over the years, I'd say. And plus, given what we know now about him and everything, and why it's a bit of it's a bit more difficult for him to game with the rest of the guys, it's I, I can under I, I hope you can understand why I put him down in D tier. Uh, he's not the if, if I, I probably should have added more tiers into this thing, but still, I would say Louis easily like he he had some very funny moments. I remember the squeaker voice, uh, and I always thought it was a voice emulation thing. I always heard it was an emulation thing, but then uh, someone showed me a video of him actually doing it in real life, and I was just thoroughly impressed. But outside of that gimmick and some pretty funny lines here and there, I uh, it's just. The years of him not uploading has sort of dampened my my perception of him as a gamer, and that's why I probably put him in D tier. Uh, then we move on to Marksman, uh, probably the best consistent gamer out of all of these guys here. I I, I would say in terms of first person shooters, uh, no one's better than Marksman, but I would also say right now he is easily uh, uh, because of the consistency on his YouTube channel. I'd say easily a B tier, but yet he doesn't. I don't have. He, he doesn't have to be impressed, or uh, he can be angry with me if he wants. But I don't know why. I mean, he's a way better gamer than I'll probably ever be. I mean, he's an actual pro gamer and gets paid to be a pro gamer. So, what? Why? Why would he? Why should he be upset about what some random YouTuber has to say about him? He his technical prowess as well is another thing too that I always tune in for, especially when he's doing a, a gameplay with. Uh, Tyler or whenever he is doing zombies or anything like that with Noah J, uh, I would say yeah, he's like he's probably the best consistent FPS gamer out of everyone here. And now we move on to the gassy one himself, Max Gonzalez, gassy Mexican, easily an A tier for me because, and I, I think right now he's been flying under the radar because I think he's he's done trying to be like way out there in terms of like the production of his stuff and instead he's found peace with where he's at and he's happy in life but there was a time dude when he was in those games with with scene anners and diction and chilled i will never forget tyrone from the malt liquor factory oh i'm gonna slice the fuck out of you bitch. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Get out. Oh, and then of course uh can't forget morgan freeman his morgan freeman impression still makes me laugh even though I have seen that video well, uh, probably at least a hundred times, it still makes me laugh. Still to this day makes me laugh. Max, can you pretend like you're Morgan Freeman coming to kill me? I can smell you. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, and also the fact, legacy-wise, uh, Machinima Respawn, and also the Creatures, uh, he's just been consistent. I've been subscribed to him on, on Twitch now for... God, years and years now, man. I I I believe I love Max, and if he were ever to game with me, I'd I, I wouldn't ask him to I wouldn't ask him to do the voice, but I would just I just want to chill and hang with him. Also, he had probably one of my favorite GTA moments ever. Just real quick, uh, he was in a helicopter with a few other people. I think it was Renee Spoon and a few others, and uh, all of a sudden. We're way over here. Wait. For oh no! Run! Oh, fuck. Run! Run! Oh, no! Oh, no! Freddy. I got it! I got it! I got it! Oh, no! dude! God fucking damn it! That was some movie I shit. Did. Oh I my god, it was so cool. I jumped out That's just right. before the missile came, and I looked up, no, and it exploded as I sky dove out. Spoon, you died. <gasps> and to complete, <laughs> to complete the movie moment, I'm gonna land perf- Oh no, I'm not. I'm gonna hit this tree. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and die. <laughs> Oh no! So yeah, Max. Max is a Max as easily an A tier for me personally. Uh, we now move on to Mini Lad. Mini Lad is yeah. I probably would put Mini either here or here. 
uh, about a few, uh, about, I'd say, a year or so ago. But, uh, also here's another thing too. By the time you're watching this, uh, we will have either privated or deleted all of our Mini Lad reactions, uh, because of everything that's happened with Mini. Uh, I, I want to believe that things will work out for the better, but at the same time, Craig admitted to it, so that's all I'm going to say about that. Now, I'm also not going to drag anyone else into this into this as well, but consi but I would say many uh, many I right now for me is solid D tier. That's that's it. That's all I got to say. Now I move on to Moo. <coughs> Moose Knuckle. So Brock and uh, Scotty have always uh, have always had a uh, very very good uh, like uh, good moments in Vanoss's videos and everything. Uh, that I've watched, and also I've watched some of his videos as well, uh, where his daughter gets involved with uh, with phasmophobia. The basement. The basement. Yeah. Macaulay. Oh, shit. What, what the, the hell, hell is that? that? It's it's a haunted. It's haunted. It's haunted with a kid. Moo! Oh my Moo. god! Damn it, Moo! That's <laughs> she got into my office. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Fucking God! I mean, you gotta go upstairs, okay? Yeah, it's really cool that he's getting his daughter into gaming that early. I, I think that's really awesome. Uh, but him living that dad life and also still remaining consistent as a YouTube gamer, I would say easily, you know, B tier, if not A tier. I, I, I go back and forth between... There's a lot of these guys, like, they move up and down. Uh, everyone here on B tier, you could pretty much, like on any other day would probably be an A tier with me, but okay. Anyway, uh, Moo, solid B, if not an A on certain cases, but now we're getting into uh, the final stretch of these. I think we're halfway through. We now come to the Nogla man. Oh, Dahi the Nogla. Well, if we were to be honest about Nogla, I'd say he probably belongs down here in D because it's green and everything uh, involved with him has to be green. So I'm going to put him... No, no. <laughs> I know that's going to miff some of y'all, but honestly, Nogla... Uh, I know people are going to say, you know, it's favoritism because I got to play with him in Among Us. What you seen in there? <laughs> Again? Okay, I am not self-reporting. I swear to fucking God. Oh, Nogla! No! Are you serious? Oh. Nogla, why aren't you going to the reactor? I like it, could you? Feline! I third imposter. So hard, dude. Holy shit. I'm so sorry. I third imposter so bad. Which, I'd love to again. Nogla, if you ever have an open spot, I know you're still playing Among Us like a friggin' fiend. You and uh, Aaliyah, if, if you'll have me. I remember I messaged Aaliyah one night on Discord, on your Discord, to see if I could get in. But the problem was. Y'all were popping, and you had, like, I think six people in waiting, and plus I was very, very tired, so I just said, ah, what the hell, and plus Aaliyah said, yeah, but probably not tonight, which is fair. I mean, uh, but if you ever do have an open spot, Nogla, hit your boy up. I'm, I'm always willing to, I'm always willing to get killed by you again, you know, get my neck snapped, get a readjustment. Yeah, Nogla, I S tier easily for me because just his way of delivery and also... His voice, and also, just uh, what he has the ability to pop off and go on a rant that uh, that rivals that of uh, Panda or Moo. Yeah, Nogla, solid S tier, uh, just for basically being being just deadpan delivery and uh, having the ability to pop off and <laughs> have some absolutely stupid moments, but it's saved because of his his comedic stylings. Uh, so yeah, that's our first S tier right there, Dahi Nogla. And now we move on to Ohm. Just gonna put that there. Uh, main reason for that is because Ohm, I tuned into a fair amount with uh, when he was playing with C Nanners and Gassy, uh, and also I would say he um, he had some funny moments, but overall, I just never I just never found his videos personally to be that entertaining. And also, the drama here recently really, to me, I I don't like the fact that he came after someone uh, came after someone someone in here. I'm not gonna get into that drama because 
they're done with it. I don't want to inflict or incite any more drama. I'm just going to leave it at that. But when you go chasing drama, in my book, you you lose you lose points. This is why I don't like Keemstar that much. But anyway, uh, now we move on to Big Jiggly Panda, the Pandalicious one. Uh, Anthony, easily an A tier. I know Nick. Nick, you'd probably put him in S tier. Uh, easily. Yeah. Uh, Nick also mentioned earlier, he said, uh, Panda was one of the ones who had, like, the scream that he found hilarious. And also people tell me I laugh like Big Jiggly Panda. Low on breath laugh. The one where I'm, like, like, on the last bits of breath in my lungs and I'm laughing. Uh, yeah, I, I can see that. I keep hearing that in those friggin' videos. It's still funny to me. Uh, but now, uh, now, again, I, I, pro I probably would put him in S tier easily because, you know, Panda across the board is still very, very funny. Like, you can go on rants that would that would make a sailor blush with shame. Adam hey, Anthony, what the fuck? <laughs> fuck yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Don't fucking start with me already, you potato! <laughs> Oh my god, he was so loud! But, again, the consistency of his videos on his channel, I find to be, like, they're more highlights than they are, they have little editing bits in there, in which, there's some people who can just subsist off of that, and who can do, uh, who don't have to have, like, you know, titles over top, or text, or text, or anything like that. Uh, I'm not saying Anthony can't, uh, I think Anthony can, it's just, the editing to me just has to be a little bit sharper, but, again... That's just that's just me. So uh, yeah, big jiggly panda, A tier, and then we have Sark. Oh, this is a tough one. I I really want to put Sark up here on S tier because just of legacy and everything. But again, Sark I have found to be very very funny, very very intriguing, and just consistent. And plus, he's got two kids. He he's got two kids. He maintains the YouTube life. And from what everyone said, he is one of the nicest guys. He's like, he has one of the nicest personalities ever when it comes to gamers. When I find you guys... You're not gonna... I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna spread your butt cheeks apart. <laughs> and I'm gonna blow into them like no. they're a Nintendo cartridge. No, no. <laughs> Sark, to me, is, is easily an A tier, if not an S tier. It uh, Again, you, you shouldn't take this tier list seriously. This is just where I am right now. Uh, will this change? Yes, it change. It'll probably change on the daily, but yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, but start easy, easy A tier. Uh, then we have C Nanners. C Nanners on C. No S. Main reason for this is because Nanners was and still is probably one of my favorite YouTubers to this day. Uh, his videos, the dolphin laugh, and also his ability to uh, just make almost any situation, like any game, whether it be prop hunt, hide and seek, uh, anything in Gmod, he can just literally make anything funny. And uh, the fact that he managed a lot of the the in betweens between uh, Gassy, Chilled, and Sark. Uh, and the various other members of the former Respawn crew, such as uh, Hutch, then there was Diction, Z, just so many of them. And, uh, yeah, I would say easily, easily an S tier for me. Uh, I'm also, as soon as he came back, I was so happy. I've been subscribed to him since, uh, since I think 2012, 2013, maybe 2011. I, I'm not 100% on that. But then, uh, when he enabled memberships, I became a member. So, yeah. That's that's another thing too, uh, and then of course we have Smitty, this the Smitty one. I uh, uh, I would say I would say an S tier, but easily Smitty is an A tier. Uh, him and Cryas like they both have that chaotic neutral energy, but Smitty I would say his video editing and also the, the consistency of his releases is a bit better than Cryas, but Smitty and his uh, predictions. In, in Rainbow Six Siege, just, it, it baffles me. It boggles the mind at just how good he is at that. They're right outside the door. Really? <laughs> 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 oh, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Holy oh, shit. First shadow case drop equals first shadow daggers, boys. What the fuck? 
What? 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 I just got Shadow Dagger's Crimson Web! No, you didn't. I did! <laughs> what the fuck? No, you didn't. I did! No, you didn't. <laughs> what the fuck? No, you didn't. Uh, then, of course, we have a uh, Spoon. Spoon right here. I would say Spoon. I have had uh, I've had some fun moments with watching Spoon. Uh, the horse mask I would say is probably like I remember the horse mask era. Good lord, that was that was interesting. That was a very very interesting time uh, when he d hadn't done his face reveal and you only saw the horse mask. Uh, and also uh, the the moments he had with Sea Nanners. No, Spoon, are you innocent? Yes, I'm innocent. Okay, then fucking guard this door with me. Anyone comes in this room, I swear to God, we'll blow you away. Yeah, you better not come in this bedroom. We'll blow you so hard. Stop doing that. <laughs> oh, God. Just so many good moments. Uh, but I haven't tuned into his main channel as much as as these others on here. But, yeah. Uh, Spoon, still a very funny guy. Easily B tier. Uh, maybe A tier if... Uh, if uh, Maybe if I tune into his videos more and he's changed it, I don't know. That Again, don't take this list seriously. Then we get to uh, Terrorizer, Brian Michael Hanby, uh, the Arnold man himself. Do the voice, do the voice. Yeah, I, I'm sorry guys, but I have to be consistent. I've got to put, yeah, yeah no, no, absolutely. I am not, I am not putting him under S tier because to me... I don't know. His live streams are always lit. I mean, his uh, his Dead by Daylight gameplays with Lene are friggin' hilarious. Um, Lene, I shall let you live. Oh, fuck you, you dirty fucking bitch! Oh, God, you oh, need yeah. him! Oh, you just kidding! Just kidding! Oh, God! Oh, you, no. you are, I love you! He doesn't have to c subsist on his voice to get over in terms of comedy. He just does what he wants, and he has fun. Uh, also, uh, also, <laughs> uh, Lene torturing him a little bit back whenever he's playing Phasmophobia in VR. That's always fun. Do, do, do you know how to use the radio? No, I... It, oh! That hurt! You're welcome. Did she pinch your ass? She slapped the fucking shit on my right cheek! Ow! <laughs> What Who are the you talking to right you now? Turn There's around there. there. <laughs> <sighs> Fuck, I'm having two dimensional bullshit. One, okay, girlfriend in a different paranormal realm. What do you want? It started yet. And also, and also just the fact that he is, he, he's come through a lot here over the last few years. You know, his dad passing away and everything. That's, that's always a tough one. Um, you know, I, I, I'm thankful to still have my dad around, but at the same time, you know, that's a hard, hard thing to, to really grasp and, and get over. And, you know, Brian did a great job of that. So, also, reaching uh, 100K on the Movember uh, charity streams. Uh, congratulations, Brian. Glad I could help contribute to that in some way. And, uh, yeah, here's to hoping that uh, here's to hoping that the future stays bright. And also, the fact that he's living here in the States right now with Lene. I think that's pretty cool. Uh, he's out on the West Coast right now, so... That's that's really cool. Okay, so uh, now we move on to the big two, like two of the like two of the bigger channels uh, in this group. Uh, Vanos, I mean, I know a lot of people are gonna be angry. I know a lot of people are gonna hate me, but yeah, a a tier. I, I would I would have said S tier a few years ago, uh, but still I, I would say consist like in terms of his video consistency can still be very very funny but here over the last few years i don't know it's just seemed like uh, i it's it's become a little bit dry over the last few years and plus uh i i know that there's other people in this group who have pretty much moved on to other things i know uh wildcat doesn't want to play gmod anymore with him because he thinks gmod's tapped out which gmod may come around again but then there of course there's minecraft which minecraft's always popping and uh you know Vanoss is always happy to do Minecraft as well. Uh, and of course, uh, yeah, his editing in the beginning was the best by far. But now everyone else has kind of caught up to him and has pretty much got their own editors. I know Nogle's got Teriyaki. I know uh, I know that Puffer used to work for basically. Uh, but yeah, 
I, I would say Vanoss, solid A tier, probably close, very close to S tier. Hey everyone, Nate here from the Wacky World of Post-Production, and uh, yeah, I felt like it was important to mention uh, Vanoss's music career as well, seeing as how that has taken up a lot of time and has taken away from his editing of his videos. I can see why it would uh, affect the quality of his videos, but still though, I mean, he's still very entertaining and still consistently entertaining, but given that and given those facts, I'd probably bump him up to S. Eh, A's still, still pretty much how I feel, but for the most part, yeah, I probably, I probably would have kicked him up to S if I'd have talked about that a little bit more. Sorry about that, but yeah, anyway, back to the vid. We now move on to Wildcat, which Tyler, I know, I know that, I know that Tyler, you know where you belong. You, you know exactly where you belong. Yeah, yeah. I, <laughs> sorry. I hate to tease like that. I really do. But uh, I have not laughed more at anybody in this entire crew. Now, there's people in this crew I have laughed a lot at, but consistently, I I have not laughed more at anybody than, than uh, Wildcat, than Tyler. <laughs> Slide in your girl's DMs like, yo! Secret agent dumb shit. I'm fucking nasty! Oh, Get the fuck off me! Alright, 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 let's go to beat. Oh, no, we're defending. Mm. Oh, I almost dicked him down with a throwing knife! Hey, go around, guys, go around, good try, GG's. Gotta look out for that, that's an AC-130 up there, be careful! I'm gonna kill a chicken and then kill this guy. Don't kill him. Okay, sorry, sorry. I did it! <laughs> Man, fuck that chicken! You see that bitch? Bop! <laughs> Finger looking good. And then of course, also, I know a lot of people are confused. It's like, if his name's Wildcat, how come his how come his icon's a pig? Go back and watch his videos in GTA uh, to understand that it's based upon a glitch. So, yeah. And they're still funny to this day. I still go back and I watch. I watch them every now and again. And the origins of the of the pig head of the pig helmet is still fucking hilarious to this day. So again, yeah, that's it. That's uh, the basic tier list that I have right there for are the banana bus van, slash vanos slash machinima respawn tier list. Uh, so yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully you all enjoyed that. Uh, this was, uh, this was, I, I'm glad I was able to do this because this, um, tier lists are always something I found interesting and I've always wanted to put mine out there to see what people think. If you think someone belongs elsewhere, feel free to let me know in the comments down below and also if I missed anybody, you know, if you want to, uh, if you want me to do other, like, other YouTubers like Do, uh, Grizzy, uh, fucking, uh, Blarg... Uh, soup, McNasty, any of them, feel free to uh, feel free to hit hit that up down in the comments. And if there's other tier lists out there that you want me to do, uh, shoot them my way. I'll be more than happy to, and I will be more than happy to uh, state my arguments. But for right now, I think that's going to do it, ladies and gentlemen. This was the uh, Vanos uh, slash Banana Bus slash Machinima Respawn tier list. Hopefully you all enjoyed, and hopefully I will see you all in the next one. So until then, I'm Nate. I'll see you then. Peace out.